now. And Bilal Kamal gets going with his footwork also. That's just another dimension this Wildcats team has. Davis trying to cross. He's able to show it me. Puts it on frame, and it's put in. Guess who again? Eli Goldman does it for the third consecutive game here in the postseason. Bombito crowding in there, trying to get ahead on it. This one comes all the way through, and the Wildcats have a second. Less than 10 minutes in, it's already 2-0 New Hampshire on the strike from the Wild Cabal. Great touch by Yannick Bright. Trying to create an opportunity. Goldman, the header saved. Rottleman with a huge stop to keep it 2-1. to one. The great uncle of uh, Crispy. Hex swings it in here for the Pirates, the header, and Seton Hall has got one back. He got goals galore to start things off. It's Constantine Donnelly's who makes it two to one. It's been so instrumental in reading those plays, those up and over plays. Nice touch by O'Driscoll, he's got Mayer. Back out wide, O'Driscoll. Back to Mayer, give and go in the box. He candles it, blocked on its way in. Boop. Swings it in, punched out. That was a heck of a boot by James Boot, and it's out for a quarter. Nine, Ten eight, seconds, seven, showing me all by himself. And that will do it. Two, one, New Hampshire is moving on in the NCAA tournament. Seton Hall, and they will play Florida International this weekend.